the Bothia Camus Verna, or Lua Sandy, <coughs> more commonly known as Rafe Payne's Bothy, the place where Gavin Maxwell and Andrew Scott stayed after the fire in 68, holds a bit of a secret, which is hidden in, in full view. On the interior gable end is a mural which most people assume was painted by Gavin Maxwell himself, or even Rafe Payne. But that's not the case. Even the estate manager at the, at the Alien Reach estate, if that's how you pronounce it, thought that Maxwell had painted it. In fact, it was painted by a guy called Morris Percival. He was a friend of Rafe Payne's and stayed there occasionally. Whilst Rafe was English master at Eton, Morris was art master as well as other colleges including Harrow, Downside and Marlborough Colleges. For the painting, for the mural, he used the available colours at Sandig. That would be the anti-fouling red for the boat, the green engine paint and the blue for the windows. He only had one arm and he stood on a stool to reach. Quite a remarkable man. His works of art held at the v &A Museum in London. In fact, so concerned was I about the condition of the mural and the possibility of removing it from a dilapidated building, because this is something I've actually seen done before, I contacted the v &A to see if that was something they may be involved with. Of course it wasn't, and they weren't interested. Perhaps if it had been a Banksy, it may have been a different story. But it seems I needn't have worried, for now at least, as the estate manager confirmed the inside is dry and sound, and the plasterwork is in good condition. And I believe the gable end, the exterior gable end, gets a coating of paint every year, to keep out the worst of the Westleys. Apparently Morris was so well thought of as a tutor that he had a lot of talented painters amongst the staff at Harrow College and they asked him for some evening lessons. He was friends with the poet David Jones and collaborated closely with Ronald Watkins on his books about staging Shakespeare's plays. He painted other murals as well, exactly the same. Another one I found was on board which hung in a church which was due for demolition. I tracked it down and it now hangs in the church hall in Stratton-on-the-Foss, which is one of the feeder parishes for Downside College. I have photographs of this as well. And I've heard of others uncovered at Tarot College, which, which came first, which mural came first, I've no idea. His assistant at Harrow, a guy called John Ryan, who later went on to develop the Captain Pugwash character. Some of you may remember him, if you're of a certain age. He wrote a glowing obituary to Morris when he died in 1981. And I'll read a little snippet here. It says, all who knew him will remember him for his strength and goodness of his personality. It positively shone from his features. He was closer to saintliness than anyone I have ever known. So there you have it. The mural in Rafe Payne's Bothy was painted by Morris Percival. I hope this is of some interest to some people, perhaps if not now, then perhaps in the future. It's over 50 years now since Maxwell died, and I think it's important that small details like this are passed on because they very, very simply just got will be forgotten. I think very few people knew of it before, if any. Uh, so hopefully a few more people will know. So thanks for listening.